my previous video, I talked about how to get inspiration from other people's work to help you design better flyers in less time. By the way, if you have not watched that video, then do well to watch because it is going to help you design better flyers in some few hours. In that video, I imported a flyer in Photoshop and it was visible outside my main canvas. That got many of you asking how do I do that and that is what I'm going to show you in this video. So let's dive in. To begin with, there are two ways you can use a workspace in Photoshop. Let me show you what I mean by that. So the first one is when you open Photoshop like this, head over to new file and click on it and this will pop up. So when it pops up, choose the dimension of your file. So in my case, I'm going to go with 10 by 10 inches at 300 ppi. The two ways of creating a document is decided by just this one. I mean, this thing at here, this thing right here, the first one, we are going to uncheck this one. As for the name of the project, I'm not going to name it right now. I'm going to leave it. We will name it later. Everything is okay. Let's click on create. Let's try importing a file and see if it's going to be shown outside the canvas. Control minus minus to zoom out. So file, place embedded. Let's go to downloads. Okay. There's it. So let's place this one outside the canvas. And then let's click on the check mark and see if it's going to work. As you can see, it is imported, but it cannot be shown outside of the canvas. Let me show you the other way of creating a workspace where that will be shown. So let's go back. So for the second method to you go to new file as we went in the first method. And then this one too will pop up again. And when it pops up, uh, you choose the dimension of your file. We are going with the same dimension we used earlier on and then everything stays intact. But the one that's going to show the difference between the previous step and this one is the add boss here. So we are going to check the add boss here like this. As you can see, the add boss here is checked. Make sure it is checked and then you click on create. Perfect. Now let's import the file. I mean the file that we imported in a previous one and let's see if that one will show right here. Let's go to file, place embedded and then let's import this flyer here put it at one side like this click on a check mark and let's see voila it is visible as you can see the previous one if you don't check the ad board it will never show but with this one we check the ad board and show so the only thing that shows the difference i mean the only thing that gives the difference is the ad board but i will create a full video explaining what ad boards can do and what you need to know about ad boards if you need that video comment i need that video in the comment section just write i need that video in the comment section and also one thing that you must also know is that let's say you created the workspace and then you want to convert it to an ad board all that you have to do is that you make sure that the background here is unlocked so you click on the padlock here to unlock and when it's unlocked you right click on the layer that is the layer zero right click on it and then you come up here you see add board from layers so you click on the add board from layers and then you can see you can name your ad board so now let me name it main click on ok and as you can see the flyer is now showing outside of our main canvas and also let's say you have created the file already i mean you have created the workspace you have designed everything you have done with the flyer and everything like what i have done here i have created the flyer i'm done with everything but i will import something at one side of it how can I convert this whole thing into an ad board where if I import something, it's going to show. Let me show you what I mean by that. Now, if I import something, it's never going to show outside of the canvas. Let's go to place, place embedded. And then let's import that same file. And then let's put it at one side like so. As you can see, it's not showing on the workspace, but we want to let it show. So to do that, come down here. As you can see, this is the first layer of, the, of this particular file. This is the first layer of it. And this layer covers the entire area of the workspace. We're going to convert everything into an ad board so that the file I imported will show. Go to right click on the right click on the layer. I mean the, the first layer. In your case, maybe when you come here, the layer here will be background and then there will be padlock. If you want to unlock that, you just click on the padlock that will be beside it and then it will be unlocked. So after unlocking it, you come right here, click on I mean you right click on it and then you go to uh yeah, ad board from layers. And then you name it so in my case i'm just going to do it main flyer click on ok and as you can see the main flyer has now turned into an ad board where the one we imported is now showing outside of it nicely i talked about how to design better flyers in some few hours in this video right here click on the video right now to learn more 
Until next time, quench not your creativity. Peace.